What's up YouTube, Glenn here. Just thought I'd bring a quick video to you guys, uh, something that I learned, and that is how to make these two play nice together. Just a run of the mill, everyday smartphone, and a high quality condenser mic that requires 48 volt phantom power. So stick around just a second, and I'll show you how to do that. So a lot of people wonder how they can get high quality audio on their YouTube videos if they're simply just using their smartphone like I do. And obviously you can tell right now that the sound quality isn't very good. Uh, I don't have an expensive camera or expensive DSLR so I had to come up with a solution. Even though I did have a nice mic, I didn't want to have to record the audio separately and record the video separately on something else and then synchronize them together later in post. So what I found was this guy right here and this is the iRig Pre. What this does is it plugs into your smartphone through the headphone jack and it supplies phantom power to a condenser mic that requires 48 volts. And so by doing that you're bypassing the mic on your cell phone or smartphone and you're using a high quality mic such as this one which is the Rode NT1A. Uh, you can check this out in the, one of my other videos. I did an unboxing of this and a review of this. Um, I'll leave the link in the description below. But by doing that, that gives you the ability to be able to record straight to your phone. You don't have to do any kind of synchronizing later on down the road. And if you are having somebody else uh, record for you using your phone, it also has a headphone out here so they can monitor audio and they can adjust the gain on the mic uh, so that way you don't get any kind of peaking or, or any distortion in your audio. They can hear and listen uh, to make sure that it is working correctly. This will work with tablets, with uh, iPads, uh, iPhones, uh, Android smartphones, pretty much any kind of smartphone. It does come with an app that you can download and be able to record audio straight to that but you can also just use the, the audio recorder on your uh, device if you want to record audio separately or if you're doing videos such as I am then you can just record straight to the video and be able to use uh, high quality audio. So uh, just a quick tip for you guys, uh, I'll leave a link in the description for this below uh, that way you guys can check it out. Uh, it's not very expensive, maybe about 40-50 bucks. Uh, but if you have any questions, please feel free to comment in the section below. Uh, please subscribe, hit that like button if this video helped, and I'll see you guys on the next one.